Welcome to Ubler's online Cadillac showroom. Today we're going to look at the 2018 Cadillac CT6 sedan. And this vehicle is radiant silver metallic in color. It's got a 3.6 liter V6 engine and an 8 speed transmission. It is all wheel drive. This is the luxury level, and we've got Goodyear um, Eagle Touring tires, 19 inch tires, and they're mounted on machined alloy pearl nickel wheels. Let's take a look inside. We do have passive keyless entry. And before we get inside, we'll look at the controls here on the door. It's a little easier to see. As you can see, we've got control here for the trunk, opening and closing the trunk. You've got the uh, uh, window controls here for all the windows and the mirrors, door locks. And then you've got controls here for the seat instead of on the side. Now they're here, a little easier to get to. And mem memory seats as well. And this is for the seat as well, too. And going inside, we've got controls right off the bat. We've got a parking brake here on the dash and the dimmer control for the lights. On the side of the steering column, you can see underneath here, we've got tilt and telescopic. So, easy to get to. Plenty of controls on the steering wheel as we get inside and look. You're going to see that we've got controls on the left side of the wheel for the uh, phone, using the phone, and the cruise control, all in one little area there. Uh, right below it, you've got controls here for forward collision alert and lane keep and departure and a heated steering wheel. You've got controls on the other side here for the driver information center and then volume up and down for the radio. Uh, we've got uh, other radio controls here for the uh, selecting your favorites, your presets on, the, on your radio screen. I'm going to start it up here so you can see the driver information and the cluster. Uh, that screen back there is an 8 inch screen and uh, shows all your vitals for your engine along with uh, a compass for direction. And then moving over to the Cadillac Q system, um, customer user experience. You've got controls on the screen as well uh, for park assist and then auto park assist uh, as well. So different controls there on the screen, all with the haptic response. When you tap here and move it back and forth, you can feel the thump letting you know that uh, you've made the connection. Just below the controls for the radio, you've got some controls here as well, too, for your heated seats and ventilated seats. You've got uh, tr uh, dual zone controls for uh, controlling the temperature. And uh, one control here for the fan speed. And moving over here, we've got this little pad. It's like a mouse pad. And as you can see as I move it around, it's moving... Uh, from item to item on your queue so you can actually control it from just moving around so makes that kind of handy now over on the passenger's door same thing controls for the seats the uh, up and down back and forth and then the lumbar as well as presets as well on the passenger side so plenty of ways to control that. Looking up in the, in the top up here in the front, you've got some controls for um, not only the sunroof, which you can open and close, the shades and the windows, but then you've got a control here too, and I'll show you for the back window, uh, a sunscreen that goes up and down. So I can open and close that. 
You've got sunscreens as well on the uh, back side windows on both sides. Uh, but those are manual, but they are very easy to pull a little tab up in the middle and uh, pull them down and get them inside a little latch there. So makes it kind of easy. Jet black interior, 10 speaker Bose sound system. It's the premium sound. It does one feature too we we're going to mention here. It does have the, uh, the rear camera or you can shift to a conventional rear view mirror and you can see the difference. There's quite a difference in the amount of visibility you're going to have going from the rear view mirror to that camera. So nice feature there as well. We're going to move to the back seat now. Jump out, get in the back, take a look. Let you get another view here of the of the car in the back. And this CT6 I mentioned was all-wheel drive. We're gonna look inside here. And again with the keyless entry, easy to get in. There's controls in the back here for, on both sides for uh, the heated seats. And you can control it with either going with the full seat or just the back, uh, depending on what you want. Here's again the latch. And this is just an easy tab you would grab, lift up, it pulls up and then it disappears down into the, into the window. So easy to do, something that uh, I know a lot of folks probably have thought of wishing they had that. Um, looking on, on the, again, the other door too, you've got uh, controls for the windows and, uh, and your, also that screen from this door control there. So it makes it easy to control the sunroof with one and then with the other one, that rear shade in the back, so. It also has a uh, an armrest that folds down from the center and uh, becomes not only an armrest but the switch of push of a button. You've got cup holders for two, and then also a little storage area that you can lift up and a place to put valuables and uh, be able to stow them as well. Pushing that button, pushing that button there that goes back. You've got a compartment entry area here to get into the back if you need to do that as well. So nice little easy to use latch. And it all folds up and out of the way. And we're going through the front and the back door. And to see silk plate is lit. So at night makes it easy to get in and out. This again is the 2018 Cadillac CT6 sedan, the all-wheel drive, and we've got it today here at Eubler's and Vincennes. Come on in, check it out, maybe take it for a test drive, or if you want to call and schedule a test drive, our number here is area code 812-316-3130. And again, Thanks for watching and uh, hope this is helpful. Thank you.